What is going on guys and welcome back to another top 3 Hunger Games servers. This one is for Minecraft 1.7.2. Now uh, I do have to preface this real quick. These are all my opinions so don't jump on me if you uh, disagree with me. And also uh, all the IPs will be in the description. Alright guys, let's jump into it. Coming in at number 3 is going to be The Nexus. Now The Nexus is Bajan Canadian's new server. It used to be called The Fridge. Um, and as you can see here it has a hub so that's pretty nice. It's pretty easy to join servers. Um, and yeah, so it has a hub, and then one thing that is interesting that makes the server different is that it has these things called mutation passes, where you can come back in the game after you have died, so you can get revenge on the person that you kill. Now, one positive about the server is that it's got bigger YouTubers like Bajan Canadian and uh, ASF Jerome. Literally, first game I went into, they were both in there. Pretty funny. Uh, but yeah, this game is more, like, this Hunger Games is more, I guess, fun-based as opposed to being skill-based, because... If you see right here in this clip, uh, when I hit this girl, it it's like all these weird sparks come off. It makes it really difficult to see. And, yeah, that actually ended up uh, hurting me later in the match. Uh, but, yeah, guys, uh, it's a pretty good server, and if you want to have fun, I definitely recommend it. Now, coming in at number two is going to be MCSG. Now, MCSG is pretty good. It has a hub just like all the other servers. Uh, and it has U.S. hub, uh, EU hub, Australian hub, Canadian hub. So it's a lot more, I guess, diverse. Uh, but the only thing I don't like is that it puts us in this room right there that I just showed, and it doesn't show when the match is going to start. But once the match does start, get ready, because it's a lot more skill-based than you're going to find on the Nexus or anything like that. You're going to find a lot of stone swords. I mean, look at this clip. Look how many people are got stone swords out of the spawn chest. Uh, but yeah, it's a lot higher. It requires a lot more skill to play MCSG. Um, the only thing that I would say, like... The only reason I would say don't play MCSG is because the the mods on here are very, very strict, and they're kind of unfair. Like, uh, I've killed a mod and been banned for killing a mod, and BSM is not, or Better Sprint is not allowed on the on this at all, so you, so you can't use it, and they, they will get you for it. They always do, so that's why it's not my number one but it, it is still a very very good server if you're willing to not use better sprint and then play very nice with the admins now finally coming in at number one is going to be the hive the hive is an extremely popular server uh, lots of people playing it lots of youtubers playing it and it's just really a re just an ultimately a great server but the only problem is it makes it very difficult to get into a game if you're not a member so it's almost kind of extremely encouraged to get membership, but it is worth it if you get it. But uh, as you can see here, I'm not reaching into a chest, I'm reaching into a crate, which makes the hive so different and cool. Now, other than spawn, crates randomly spawn throughout the map on the hive, which makes it so awesome. So, it, you know, if you're playing MCSG, it's like, oh, okay, I have my chest route, I'm gonna run this way, I'm gonna run this way, get this and that, you know, and then, okay, I'm looted, now I'm gonna win. This, the Hive offers a different experience because it's like, well, I gotta, I kinda gotta go my own way here. I don't have to run the same exact route. I can find different chests and, and it just makes for an ultimately really interesting experience and it kinda just randomizes it every time. And this is the server that I do my Hunger Games on for the most part. Uh, but yeah, guys, I mean, that, that, that's the top three. Um, the Nexus, MCSG, and the Hive. I mean, I really hope you guys enjoyed this video. I hope it helped. Remember, all the IPs will be in the description. If you did enjoy, please drop a like. That'll mean a lot to me. And uh, if you want to come check out my Hunger Games, I'm extremely deep into them. I'm 125 deep, and we're, uh, we're going strong here. So if you want to come check out my stuff, uh, check out a video and subscribe and all that fun jazz. But other than that, guys, I'm Cash, and uh, I'm outie.